there. Welcome to episode eight of our podcast. Woo! Yeah, featuring myself, Will, Christopher, and Samuel we over do, here. We do this every time as if they don't know who we are already. No, I know. I know you They're guys are very familiar at this point with us. Um, yeah, definitely. They, they know us all across the world. Yeah. Across the world, our viewers. So, what do you want to talk about, William? So, guys, well, we planned a little bit for this podcast. A so, lot, actually. Yeah, a lot. We have a couple of, well, three, I think, topics. That mm-hmm. main main topics that we're gonna, three main topics that we might split off into a little bit. Yeah. Right. Dip, 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 dip into it if we want to. Dividend. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> guys, we just hop right into it. Let's go, William. Let's go. Okay, propose us on the first prompt. Let's first question go. is... What motivates you in life, etc? Parents, yourself, future. Oh, right, who wrote this question? Was it? Was it? That it was, was not me, actually. It, it wasn't, wasn't me. It wasn't I think that was you last time. It must have been me then. <clears throat> well, then, um, I think it's a very interesting question. Yes. Because I guess you always get the, the typical like, what made you go to this uni? What made you? Yeah. Why are we working this? hard in IB? For whom? Now? For yeah. whom? For whom? For whom? whom? For whom art thou? Whom? <laughs> exactly. Do you guys want to go ahead? Who, who motivates you? Is it yourself that motivates you? Definitely uh, not, no. I would no? say for me, it's myself. <laughs> definitely. I'll, uh, I'll take the challenge on this one. So, um, for me, definitely, I'd say no. that... <laughs> no. <laughs> for for um, everything that I sort of try to succeed in, so whether that be school or just my yeah. personal social life, I know it's kind of hard to say, like, yes, I succeeded in, yeah. in friendship. Yeah, exactly. But, yeah. but having that sort of... You know what I mean by success in yeah, social life. Sort of uh, being at being at a point where you enjoy being with the people that surround you and you like yeah. feel happy. <laughs> that was a nice <laughs> part there, Sam. <laughs> <laughs> actually, actually, I can't tell which one that was. It was Will. It was, it was Will. No, 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 that was Sam. <laughs> no way, that was Will. Oh all my day. god, it's like this is oh like we saw from Us. This is like in a manga. This is like in a manga. We saw that episode. How much? He just self-reported. He just self-reported. He just self-reported in your farm. Stop saying that. Sorry. Okay. I'll I'll be the bigger man. It was me. Okay. We're all talking. Definitely wasn't. Okay. Please. Um, yeah, so I, I do it all for myself and sort of, it might sound selfish, but I think it's actually better to mm-hmm. be motivated by yourself instead of um, by someone else. I think, yeah. Because, I, I'm, because that yeah. means that you can actually, like, be truly happy with what you, you're you see, You see the goal and not, not someone else. Yeah, exactly. For exactly. You. So you Sam, mean, so are you a bit the same, Sam? I'd probably say I'm the same. Same, Sam? Obviously, there's obviously a bit of persuasion involved, you know. Mm. Um, society. society not your society, parents my parents yeah. and my yeah. brothers parents want you to succeed my brothers I, you know oh my God. I, I guess it's just persuasion from, from lots of places but I'm, I'm guessing yeah it, it mostly comes from intern, you know, internally I think I yes. guess well I mean for me so I'm the oldest child in my family so I don't really have anyone to compare to yeah. yet um, and I'd say I'm not much of a self motivator so you know, I'm not very good at you know just getting getting down with myself and just doing something um, right. for for just myself. Well, it depends. It depends. I think I think. I think but obviously, yeah. school wise, uh, yeah. would you say you're not very self motivated? But for other stuff, not like, really. Yeah. What yeah, about like sports? Well, well I I no sports. I, I love playing sports. So I mean, I, so I just play sports because something I enjoy doing. And and, and in well. that way, you are motivating yourself, aren't you? You know, you're like yeah, motivated fine, to have fun. So, um, yeah, but well, I'm just motivated because I like doing it. Yeah, I think it, it's yeah. something. But then I think for everything else, like school included, you know, I want to go to university because I know my friends will be going to university. And obviously, I've heard stuff about university how it's you know interesting and you can have a lot of fun and you can meet people. And then it leads you on to you know later in life when when you need to get a job or whatever. It's very useful. So I mean, that's one of the reasons it's why. Nice and convenient. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, uh, <clears throat> future job is kind of included then. Yeah. Future jobs kind of really that, that might be something motivating. At the forefront yeah. of what you but I mean, I don't know what I want to do yet, so I'm yeah. still waiting yeah. for that like spark, the the epiphany. Chris, you know what you want to do, right? You want to hopefully, be... yeah. I mean, of course, that may change. I'm, I'm always, I don't want to put myself into like a <coughs> too strict box of what I'm gonna be, but I'm hoping to become an architect. Um, and and like so far, my interests have just been completely aligned with that, so uh, yeah, that's well, sort of what I've got my course set towards. But more than that, I think um, it's about what motivates me and possibly you guys as well. I guess everyone is motivated by this is having that eventual sort of happiness in life, yeah. that, that sort of success for yourself. But where you're, um, and I, I, I am personally couldn't care less about monetary that, gains at all. At all, that doesn't interest me. I just want to have enough to like sustain my family and I. 
and my interests, you know? So, I do feel like, obviously, but I feel like having a bit more money than the... Why <laughs> 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 you do that in your face? It's coughing, that's why. No, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you can't <laughs> no, It will pick it up, guys. Leave a comment down below if you saw that. <laughs> the No Wipe Challenge. Oh, wait. We can't oh. say this episode. Oh, sorry. Oh. I'll like, tell you next episode with yeah. the No Wipe Challenge. We decided to uh, postpone it. Postpone it one, because it's like such a big thing. It's like yeah. huge. I mean, we'll leave it to when we don't have anything to talk it about. Affect, it could affect the whole world. Honestly, honestly, it could. It's like our billion dollar idea yeah. that we would go to Shark Tank with. Honestly, or honestly, how many subscribers are we at at the moment? Uh, we're like 20. 25. Let's yeah. go! Yeah, we're like 25 loyal subscribers. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if you start a membership. I was, I was <laughs> just saying, boys, I'm just saying, maybe it's a milestone, you know, whenever we hit 50 no, 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 or 100. 100? No, 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 we're not going to hit 100. 100 subscribers. We will. We're not yeah, growing we're Okay, okay, we're should we say, should we say, should we say, should we say 50 subscribers? I'm, no one I'm, I'm special. Say, I'm saying 21. 10th anniversary, episode 10, we do something special. Okay, yes. Away, yeah. Some yeah. special. We can do Maybe an episode, episode in the dark. <laughs> no, I mean, yeah, so we turn cool. the lights on. Crazy. crazy. <laughs> it's so crazy. Anyway, what are they talking we about? We wear glow sticks. I think, but the money thing. Yes. I think that always having a bit more money than the bare minimum to sustain your family is obviously what makes it nice, for, you know what I mean? Yeah. I, I don't. Yeah. Yes. Trying to push something out. Okay. Yeah. Sorry. Go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> yeah, that's basically my point. Are oh, you making those noises, well? <laughs> okay. I just really need to go. Uh, do you want to go to the toilet? toilet? <laughs> we come right back in. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, guys. No, no. no you can't do it mid-episode. So oh, really? Okay. okay. Yeah, okay. <laughs> All right, guys. It says that in the podcast rule book. <laughs> God damn it. Anyways, right. should we move on? Are you guys all happy yeah, with your responses? With yeah, I am, I am happy with my so response. Okay, you want to take question take number on. two, Samuel? All right, guys, we got... Um, That's just yours. It's got your name right now. got a hack right? question coming in. Who wrote this one? Ooh. What was that accent? Hack <laughs> question? <laughs> it's like American. Who are, so the question is, uh, what in your life brings you the most joy? Will. And has the brackets big and wholesome one? It's true. It's I wrote I wrote big and wholesome one, uh, but I didn't come up with. Uh, was it you? I didn't write. It must have been me. Yeah. I must have wrote. Like Sam's got like some happy ones. I mean, I've got so some Chris. Ones Chris kind of talked yeah, briefly got... about that in the last question. Yeah, like what, how Chris yeah. wants to settle down. What brings you most joy? So family, yeah, friends, bring definitely you family. I think I think I think for all of us, that can be key. But let's let's, yeah. let's think about outside the box. Like, if, it, if it's other than that, what I want uh, uh, for my job, I mean, outside of family and friends, is I want a job that is fulfilling. You know, I don't want to go to. a an office desk every day where you know I spend eight hours thinking about how I want to shoot myself yeah. you know yeah, yeah. I mean hopefully I'll do something where and that's why I want to do architecture it's something that's a bit creative where I might actually enjoy myself in my job and make it my profession that I can like sustain my family with so that would be ideal but I, I don't think that's unique to me at all I think that's pretty like general throughout it everyone right i mean there's no one that's like yes i'm hoping to be an accountant yeah well yeah. no well, i think there's some people are. you know what brings me <laughs> seriously i think oh, oh they're obviously really oh, i would love to be a financial advisor i yeah. I'm still good i think it would be like that may there, i take there, the, the things for every every job people want to be true may i take the parole Go on. negative you know <laughs> you know something which really brings me joy you know, some farting, stupid, when, like like when you when you poop and you wipe and there's nothing on the paper. Oh, thank you. You know what I pause now? No, 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 no. Is that is that the one thing that brings you joy? You it's, no, it's something that like after that you just run out the house like knee slide. <laughs> yeah. No. Okay. No. No. Okay. We're scoring a goal in football. Or like scoring, scoring <laughs> in a relatable moment. Which doesn't happen very much for me, but like, I don't know, something like... Same. No, you know when, when you're under a lot of pressure and you do something which is like really, really... Good. Like, yeah, I don't know, like when you're, for example, in rugby, when we're in a like really tense game and you score like the winning try. And then you touch... Uh, I remember when you, when you touch the, tr uh, the ball down on the line before we actually scored, <laughs> so we lose the game. <laughs> and that, that was really cool as well. That was many years ago, Sam. That? that was like two months ago. No, and what are you saying? That was like two seasons ago, Sam. That was in the first season. Okay, well, anyway, guys, Will, Will basically lost the whole game. <laughs> I ran about 80 meters of the pitch. I, no, I, you I get, did it. I'm sorry, I, no, I just you did, did it. I just did no, it. you did it. About five meters outside our touch line. Okay, okay, wait. What about, what about that time that you tripped to mid-pitch? You fell over your own feet and like landed. But it didn't lose them the game, right? Yeah, I, we we kept the ball. Yeah, we did we lose won the, the game. game against Israel. No, no we won. That wasn't Israel. Who was that? No, that was like the. Okay, the viewers can't relate to this. We'll just move on from this. Yeah, yeah, you know, big games. We, but the thing is, Will's rubbish at rugby. That's the bottom line. Thanks, Sam. So what are you saying about your your joy thing? Well, uh, yeah, when you Wiping. do something good and like it's 
<laughs> would you rewarded. Say, would you say that that applies to the wiping thing? So it's like when you're in a really stressful situation <laughs> like, and everything works out <laughs> and there's no poo on the paper. Is that... I mean, does there's, that, no, there's no poo on the paper. Where situation. does the poo go? <laughs> if there's no poo on the paper, Wait, like, like, where did the poo go? Well, I'm like, gonna talk about this right now. Did well, it like, disappear? Just get... your ass. Yeah. What? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. It gets lost in photosynthesis. <laughs> that's what happens. Uh, the photosynthesis. Yes, that's just how it dissolves it works. into your skin. Alright, guys, we've got another one. Oh my wait, god, wait, this, is, this episode has been so awful. <laughs> I'm sorry guys, okay, I'll be, I'll be quiet. No, no, sorry no, Sam, you didn't, you didn't tell us about what you did. Punching. I don't get this persona that you guys are getting. Punching like, Harry. <laughs> okay Sam, you know, talk to us a bit about it. Let out some anger. No, I don't have any anger. Sam has no anger to let out. I don't get what you're No, just, just get it off your chest, whatever you need. Get it off that chest of yours. I'm not, I have nothing on my chest to, to give. <laughs> no, but to get you off. just told me like you don't understand what what that persona. Uh, you, yeah, sorry. <laughs> you were like, oh my god, like, guys. What did you say, Sam? Stop doing that, Sam. Stop. I, doing I don't know what you're talking about. All right, let me take charge of the situation here, Sam. What brings you joy? I don't know. That's what I'm saying. That's, I haven't really thought about this question. What about playing PlayStation? That brings you joy. That brings it? everyone joy. No. Like, like, yeah. pl- like, as if you said that. Uh, well, that still counts, doesn't, doesn't it? it? Before, yeah. But I think it's quite yeah, a big question. I think we can move on from that because you guys. Covered it pretty well. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Chris, you want to talk about? Wait, that? wait, Chris. Oh. You wanna, you wanna take the last question? I mean, I did one. So. Okay, so this one goes: When talking to girls, do you feel the need Ooh. to put on a flirty persona, or can you be yourself one hundred percent? Oh, Sam, oh, this is this yeah. is this is one that applies for you. Go ahead, answer it. Answer in the comments below. Answer in the comments below. And tag us so you can see and on Instagram posts as well. Um, uh, what do you guys think? I think personally, you can be yourself. One hundred percent myself. And you're gonna say that? Yeah, because you're so you're self-confident, which is good. Well, I don't know, man. Do you? How about from an from an outsider looking in? Do you feel that we are the same? I think when we're around girls, because I definitely would say that we all change. Like 100%. I think well, that's natural. We all yeah. change a little yeah. bit. That's yeah. obviously. If, if it's in the front. I think that's more just nerves. Like when you're nervous, you tend to like be a little bit less open yeah. to everything and else. also and also we're not really at that like third grade stage anymore where it's like i need to look big and strong and like show yeah, that yeah. i'm really good at i can lift the big chair <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah you know i mean it's more based off yourself yeah. now i guess i think yeah yeah well i mean what do you guys feel from from what i've heard girls are like you know confident guys who are you know just themselves around the girls but just like me yeah you know same thing. Say? but um I mean, like, obviously that all goes out the window once you see, you know, for example, you see a girl that you really fancy and you talk to her and then you kind of just, like, <laughs> completely mess it up because you're going like, ooh, ooh. Have you ever experienced that before? No, uh, not that I can. I, 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 think I, it, I, I do experience yeah. that where I, like, I, I say, like, really dumb stuff where I'm like, oh. Why would you do yeah, that? No, yeah, <laughs> like, no, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's like, that's not what you would say. <laughs> yeah, no, like, are you, like, smiling off, like, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Exactly, like, <laughs> yeah, like, why do you say that? Boiling like a tea kettle. Absolutely, <laughs> absolutely. Now, I think also, you know, when we, we go out sometimes and uh, when you're when you're drinking, um, which is totally legal since we're all seventeen here. Yeah. Um, oh, we'll we'll cover that after. We'll oh, cover that after. Yeah, oh yeah. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Anyways, where yeah, sometimes when you drink, you know, you do stuff which is a little bit not not like bad, but you just you you're like a different version of yourself. Mm-hmm. I guess. Mm-hmm. I mean. I, well, I under the influence of alcohol, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah I mean, yeah. you. Everybody's like gone back and seen pictures or videos of yourself when you're just like you look a bit like oh yeah yeah, 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 yeah definitely. Okay. And so, what, what what are you saying from that? Like um, you. I mean, sometimes if you meet somebody on the night out when you're you regret your you've had you some say. alcohol. Well, no, but oh, you, you think you're it, not... you think it makes it easier? Do you think it makes you definitely. more yourself? Like you become yourself more when you're not oh. held back by your. Uh... You could say it's it's like for. Uh, further away from yourself or close to yourself, yeah. so you can be. Free. I think it's just a more extreme version of yourself. So you get yeah. somebody who's like quite an like aggressive person. You give them alcohol, and they're like twelve times more aggressive. Yeah. I would I mean, say sometimes yeah. though, you meet someone and then they turn into like a crying drunk, where it's like, oh, oh yeah, that's, that's strange. That's often, that's often a weird girls. One. Oh, often, like from what I've heard, that's that's girls get that. Yeah. So what's the problem again? So um, do you feel? I I feel like 
It depends. If, if I really fancy the girl, then I, I think I do obviously change. Yeah. Like, yeah. That's, I think that's natural for everyone. Which is, which is a shame because honestly, yeah. the best thing is being yourself. And that's what I, I've really tried so hard on myself. Yeah, it's, it's not like, it's not yeah. like I, I, I change as in like, like cool guy face. Like, <laughs> yeah, like, my name's Stanley. Yeah, like, like, quit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I'm just like, like, like I'm, I'm pretty cool. I'm just like, I think I'm a bit more. I was on the baseball team. Yeah, I'm not like as adventurous with my jokes or something like that. I'm not as like, um, I'm quite. I'm a bit more reserved. I'd say. Uh, I think we like, turn in careful. Mm, uh, we become more polite. I would say across the board, right? Yeah. yeah. You know, there's no like farting yeah. anymore, uh, and that, uh, for obvious reasons. No, I think I can't. I can't be my true self. Yeah. Like, no, I'm really I could never be like. Like your true self, Chris. Like. Could you not when like, I. Not when I first yeah, meet yeah, someone, yeah, but yeah. once I I know someone. Yeah, yeah. 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 I think of so. Course, yeah, yeah. Yeah. I agree with that. I was gonna say. Um, you know. You know. Back like say like 1980s when there wasn't like all kinds of social media I stuff. I was about to say like back scratches or like back itches. <laughs> yeah, back scratches. <laughs> well, yeah, really I say that? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, well, back when our parents were growing up, um, like those times, before yeah. social media and everything, I'm sure it was much harder to meet girls, but when you met girls, or like when you met people in general, say you'd go to a bar and you would meet a girl, you would just talk to them without knowing them at all, anything about them, without having like, well, you would have some prejudices, but like not, like as strong as you would no, with social yeah. media no. like in luxembourg especially i know everybody it's like, like i will know but i won't have to know them personally but like i'll see uh say a short girl wearing like a black leather jacket like feel a stomper shoes i'm like yeah that's a luxembourgish girl 100 all right so racial and profiling comes into it kind of yeah but you, you know you know about officer. and also you know about most people like um, sam you were telling me this the other day but you you're looking forward to going to uni because you'll be able to meet new no, people. That's, that's, exactly, oh, yeah, yeah, that's, that's so true. true. I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm not, I'm not tired. Of course not. I'm always, I'm yeah. always happy for it. But I just feel like I have preconceptions of everyone I meet. Like mm. everybody that's out now. Yeah, I feel like everyone's. Um, uh, how do I say this? Everyone's kind of like in the same sort of. It's hard to explain it, but in, in Luxembourg, I feel like everyone's kind of like. Together, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, so, I everybody quite, knows uh, it's quite a, a close. Um, What's that monotonous? Monotonous. Yeah. Type uh, of, uh, no, it's, same. It's like, like same. Yeah, 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 kind of. I like, guess so. When I want to go to uni, I feel like it's gonna be so different. People, from, yeah. I'm so excited to go to uni for just yeah. for the reasons to meet a new whole people. new set of people. I had yeah. no idea who they are. You make that sound like you don't like any of us. Like, I can't. Well, no, 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 no. But he means like on nights out and stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah no, no, no. Yeah, I, you know I me. Mean? If, if I could, I'd bring. I'd go to the same uni with all the boys. Yeah, you know I mean? oh, yeah that'd be so cool. cool. That'd be so cool. Uh, um, Guys, ever come to Copenhagen? Learn yeah, Danish in yeah, a year. Yeah, and like do do architecture and get really good at it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that'd be so that's cool. That's probably like, better than Chris. Yeah, Chris. This whole time, yeah. this yeah. whole time, I've been like, so, I've been home like drawing. Like he no. is like Banksy. Like, yeah, Banksy. Banksy. Got like nothing to do with architecture. So. Oh, he just some, he's oh, Banksy's an oh, artist. Okay. Art. Yeah, French art. Art. Oh, you have an art account, actually, don't you? Sorry. You have an art account. We've talked about yeah, it. We have mentioned that before. Yeah. Right. We well, guys, if you can hear uh, music in the background, like episode three or something, yeah, yeah, yeah. we have a musician behind us in the other studio. Yeah. Quite good, actually. actually. It's, it's actually good. really good. Yeah. It's quite good. If you see this, should we, should we tag them? If we know they're at? I don't. Ah, I don't okay. Know. Well, that's a shame. Yeah. We'll stop well, on that sentence. Some pretty talented uh, two, two, three guys, maybe, yeah. in the grade below. Yeah. They, they have like a kind of music. We're yeah, about the 17, what, what were we talking about the 17? How we're all 17? Chris, oh, it was yeah. my birthday. Yeah, it was my birthday yesterday. Yesterday. Yeah. How was that? I, you sent, Chris sent me um, a picture, right, of, he took a picture of like, a, like an orange um, menu card. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I was, I was so cool. I was yeah, so, it was my, Oh, was that your family? Yeah. I no, thought I was, that was like a restaurant. my brother. No, 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 no. They oh. had like made that for me. Oh, so, like, that's you know. so cute. Yeah, it was really amazing. It was my brother, shout out, yeah. Christoph, and his friend Luke. Because uh, oh, nice. yeah, they 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 spent the whole evening, two days actually. So they cooked it as well. Yeah, they cooked it. That's so nice. So, so they they made this whole. So what, it was great. They what had was it? right. So starter was um, a champagne and artichoke soup. Okay. Oh, I've never wow. heard of that. Second course was yeah, it was very nice. Exotic. There was like bacon bits in it. Yeah. Oh, I love, I love bacon. bacon bits. I knew you were gonna say that. I love bacon. <laughs> <laughs> and then uh, second course we had lamb. With, but like lamb Wellington, so it was in like a puff pastry. Yeah, yeah. I've never had that. I've seen Gordon Ramsay. I've seen, I've seen uh, like Master Chef. They always do it. Like, Can you put up the three sound effect videos of Gordon Ramsay right now? Like the the one where he sounds like he wants to do yeah, something how, funky. How should we format it? Like just like just like just like cut the episode cut the whole here. episode right here, and yeah. you have three sounds of Gordon Ramsay now. Yeah. Oh. Grab a leaf, lift it up. Mm. At that, 
Oh boy. Okay. Okay. Now that the sounds are done. Now the sounds are done. Uh, but yeah, it was amazing. And then uh, he finished it off with a uh, risotto. Risotto with what? Like like halal. Risotto like with uh, um, mushrooms. He had fried parmesan, so it makes like a a crisp, like a, a crisp thing. A twill, exactly. Yeah. I watched Master yeah, Chef. Yeah, I watched Master Chef. Oh my guys, <laughs> what's on twill? Which one is the the best Master Chef for you guys? What do you mean, like UK, US, or what? UK, US, Australia, or like Australia, which Australia. which brand, like amateur or professionals? Professional. Mine, mine is definitely UK professionals. Or, or, or so good. Celebrities is also quite good. Though. Celebrities, like celebrities also, right. one. Also, yeah. the Great British Bake Off. You guys watch that? Oh yeah, I watch it, but the with, Danish one, Mary the Danish Bake Off. Did you do it as well? It's exactly the same. Format. I don't, I don't like the professionals because they're usually all so close. Like they're all like quite good, but I, I like the no, I amateurs love... one because some of them are so bad. Yeah, that's <laughs> some, some of them. Bad. But they think, <laughs> but they so think that they're so good. <laughs> Like they think that they're pros, but they're really awful. It's quite funny. Yeah, it's honestly quite funny. It's quite funny. Also, the, the um, there's one called the Great British Menu, where they get Michelin star chefs from like all over the country. It's really good. Like, honestly, you should start watching it. Have you guys ever been to a Michelin star restaurant? I've been to a three star Michelin. I went to a Michelin twice. star Chinese restaurant in in Soho, London. It was like oh um yeah, that I think one. I know what you mean. You, you know? I think I know. Is it? No, it's not one keys. It's, it's for me. You know? <laughs> uh, no, do you, probably, do you know? Like, no, uh, no, no, no. Anyway, I, I love, I don't have enough of it, but Chinese food. Oh, so, I, I, I'm, I'm not a fan. So good. Really? Like dumplings and all that? I think other Asian food is so much better. Like Thai. Like Thai food is, is the best taste. Yeah, yeah. Thai, Thai food, food is so good. Japanese. Thai food. And Japanese food is Japanese. amazing. Vietnamese. Yeah, Vietnamese. Honestly, the whole like Oriental Asian Vietnamese food section Indian is like really so good. much better than Indian, 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 oh, Indian food. So boys. What's your go-to Indian order? I don't know, Indian oh. Rogan Josh, rice, naan bread. Rogan Josh. <laughs> that was a Rogan Josh. <laughs> Rogan Josh. Rogan Josh. Yes, it's, it's like, like J. I'll put I'll put a picture of it right right there. It's like, it's I, like, I like like it's a nice uh, Swedish curry. Yeah, I like a korma. My order. Like a korma, but a bit more. Uh... <laughs> Rogan Josh. <laughs> it's just called Josh. Wow. Never heard, guys. It's like <laughs> the most. Co- it's like one of the most common. It's like the second one on the Indian menu. The viewers will probably know about it, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Rogan Josh. We got any about. Indian fans here? Comment down below. What does Rogan Josh taste like? It's a smoky and sweet taste. Smoky sweet. It's not sweet really though. It bites the tongue. It's the onions which have been browned in oil or ghee. Ghee. Do you guys fat. know what ghee is? It's fat. Yeah. Butter. Ooh. Have you ever had the buttered chicken? Butter butter chicken butter 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 butter. Like buttered chicken curry. Yeah. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah no, no, no. It's so good, man. Do you know, do you know I just Maddie Madison's that. butter chicken on YouTube? Maddie Madison. You should put, know, put know, a watch all food channels, don't you? I do. No, no, but he, he watches like pure eating food channels. Like the guy that eats like 12 sticks of butter. <laughs> the, guy, the guy that eats a shoe. Yeah. And Will's just like, they're like, oh, I, want to I mean, you can't really classify that as like a food channel, do you know what I mean? No, no, he, he marinates it, mate. He, he, mar- he marinates the shoe. He marinates yeah. and batters it. Like, puts it in batter and then deep fries it. So good. And he eats the shoe. Because it's leather, it's kind of like meaty. Yeah, it's cow. <laughs> it must so be like some really slick shoes, like like yeah, they are, they are. I think suede shoes, like elf yeah. shoes. <laughs> 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 uh, 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 <laughs> like guys, what do you guys think of the school? <laughs> What's going on? This episode is such a fever dream, <laughs> guys. <laughs> guys, please. What? I have a I have what? a little thing. Yeah. Okay. Do you guys, what do you guys think of the school lunches? What do you mean, like like organization or like in terms of like everything, f- like food quality, like food quality. I think for school lunch, it's I think really it's good. I think it's amazing. Yeah. Like there's there's no day I come to school I apart from sometimes they hit us with like the the gorgonzola cheese oh, sauce on that. the pasta I love, I love and like that. the salmon yeah. fish on main dish. Like it's kind of hard to choose between <laughs> them. <too. laughs> I, I love I love cheese and I love salmon. It's yeah. just like. I don't know, just when like school salmon and like school was... blue cheese. <laughs> yeah, 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 I like it. Not for me. I, I, think, I can't really uh, compare it because I've been to ISL my whole life, so yeah. I can't really compare it to others. But, yeah, same. But just like hearing from people and seeing online stuff, I think we have a, like a, a very Actually, good. Actually, I very went lovely. to before I went to ISL. I was in Sweden, mm-hmm. and I was in this like little American Christian school that was taught in a church. Oh, like, how right. old were you? Like four. Up till I was four. Oh, right. And uh, I remember because it was like Christian and Puritan or Protestant and Puritan, we would have like a single potato for lunch every day. <laughs> like a single solid <laughs> potato. Like, thank you, Lord, for this amazing potato. Did you have to say grace? Yeah, yeah, what every day. Doing? It was like a boiled potato. Yeah, it was a oh, boiled potato. Oh, like boiled no salt, potato. no salt, oh, because guys, salt is too much. That's a new one. Let's rank your, what did we do last time? Burgers. Oh, it was ranked our burgers. No, we did another one as well. Like best type of, um. It was best type of burger. Oh, yeah, it was something else. It was like, 
You guys really disagreed with eggs. We did eggs. eggs now yeah. I'm just doing what's your favorite like potato? Like boiled egg. That's just like potato, so potato. Like like right. potato. Like, like definitely like, roasty like, number one. Like a hundred percent. Yeah, like like, like like wedges, like roasted wedges. Roasties, no, 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 they're different. Yeah. Yeah. What's a roasties, roasties mate? It's like what you have on Christmas. Roast potatoes. Oh yeah, 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 I agree, I agree. They're 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 top two. Your potato duffel was is like yeah. Oh, gratin. Actually, actually, guys, I'm gonna disagree with you because my brother made the most amazing. The other day, so uh, I'm gonna put that number that, one. That's number two, roasted potatoes. Roasted potatoes. Roasted potatoes. And you put that down number one because no, that's a mashed that potatoes isn't just down potato. That's that 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 is like cheese and like if we're talking like just potato. No, no, but it's a potato dish. Like it's based no. on a potato. No, 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 that's a potato dish. Yeah, that's okay, potato. yeah. Well, I mean, okay, then it roasties. 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 Okay, no, then I'll put that down one. Yeah, because it's yeah. when you have it, it's schooly. No, I, I, so I think you do roasties right, like on Christmas Day, like. Better. Yeah. Something changes like me, you know what I mean? It's like wow, this is amazing. <laughs> this is delicious. Well, it's like delicious. seasoned to perfection. Also, where does boiled potatoes can go like right down there? Yeah, no, I boiled... don't mind boiled potatoes because look in, in Denmark know. we don't like like peel it and make it nice and eggy. We we just like boil the potato in its skin. Well, same as like, yeah, the small yeah, ones. Yeah, yeah. The small ones. Yeah, yeah. they have at school. Th- those are like totally fine. But the ones they did in school where they like, peel it. I don't know why they do that. So gross. But we no, we do the one with the skin. It's still rubbish. It's yeah, like, I don't actually it's like. like Potato. Food. Yeah. Oh, do you okay. salt? Do you salt the water enough? Yes, we do everything. Right? Yeah. Do you, Do you eat it with bernet sauce? Uh, no, like, no, 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 like, like yeah. mayonnaise. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, obviously, if you eat it with like, oh yes, potatoes and mayonnaise, just like boiled. Okay, potato. okay. That's, un- that's unfair. If you just say it tastes good with bur- everything, tastes good with bernet. Yeah, yeah that's, that's true. Like the Especially best. cereal. The, yeah. <laughs> Wait, uh, Especially my orange juice. Okay, what, what goes What goes below <laughs> boiled potato then for you? I would say mashed potato comes above boiled potato, right? The one goes below uh, boiled. Yeah. I think boiled is at the bottom. Oh, Adam, there's probably some like, like oh yes, delicious like potato <laughs> yeah, stew. Yeah, like, we did the raw, like, like extra fish stew. Oh, like, crisps <laughs> number one. Oh, oh man, no, crisps no, no. so good. Oh, oh, I'd, my. I'd say fries. <laughs> oh yeah, Chips. fries, mate. Like, uh, Cone fries. No waffle Ch- fries. I'm, 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 have I made that clear? I don't really like chips. Oh. What about sweet oh, potatoes? The oh, su- oh, the su- oh, wait, chips like oh, sweet like potatoes. potatoes. Yeah, yeah oh, but that's, that's that's like a whole yeah, that's like, true. That's, that's a yam, that's yam, that's yam. Different. You guys like yams? Comment Addicted. down below. Honestly, guys, have you had um, sweet potato mash? Oh, oh that's better than sweet potato. Like, oh, so bad, guys. You know it. It's so bad, oh, guys. Guys, do you remember when I made sweet potato mash for you guys? Oh yeah, oh, yeah. And hot dogs. And the hot dogs. I made hot dogs and sweet potato mash for you guys. That was very, very good. Thank you. Yes, it was delicious. Yes. I put something different in it. <laughs> put something different in it. <laughs> Honestly, oh, it's okay. You guys, do you have, do you have anything, uh, anything, any last things to talk about? Um, um I'm Jerusalem Lemma dance tomorrow. Jerusalem. Actually, are you guys, behind? I don't care about that. Yeah. How, Spirit Week, what, what are you guys coming out? Oh yeah, the Spirit days? Week, as, oh, they're discussing some, it as we speak. Some of you guys know that the seniors did it, and I think our grade, or, 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 is the yeah. salt team doing something about it? Yeah, yeah. basically, um, the the twelfth grade did it, and our salt team wanted to organize one for us as well. I, that's I yeah. find it's cool, but like at the same time, I think it's special because it's like a twelfth grader. It's thing. not it's like a senior. Th- like like what I'm what I mean is the twelfth graders should be allowed to do so much more yeah. than yeah, just yeah, like true. dress up funny. Yeah, you yeah know? that's true. I think the dress up funny should be everyone's, and then the senior should be allowed to you know like toilet paper yeah, at school. Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. that's like their privilege. They should have like a prank week instead of like a prank day. So like every day they do something different. Well, everyone, no, I think no, one big one and grand ones like yeah. cool, like little mini ones is like a bit. Yeah, it's bad. No, but yeah. So what about Spirit Week? What, what are you guys coming out? I know there's a day where you have to come as a like a celebrity or a movie character or something. Really? Like that. Has it yeah. been like, confirmed? It's, it hasn't been confirmed yet. Yeah, they're confirming it right now as mm-hmm. we speak. Like in like upstairs. In the yeah, room. yeah. Oh, true. What if they come back? Because it's like yes, yeah, come as your favorite yeah, vegetable. Like, yeah, like green <laughs> and purple day. Yeah. Exactly. Oh! Yeah. <laughs> I can't wait for cross cross dress day. I want to do gender swap day. That'd be funny. Yeah. I, I just don't have any like dresses at home. Mate, just ask your mom. Ask your sister. My mom's like one sixty. I'm like two one meter. Yeah, but the point is, it's not meant to like fit. Yeah. It's not like oh really, really, damn it, it doesn't like, fit. Really nice. Yeah, but nice dress. Seriously, guys, <laughs> guys, there's like a real risk that my balls will be hanging out. <laughs> okay. Like I don't know if that you guys want to see that. <laughs> I don't know. Some might. Like, or you might cut off your t-shirts for like for that one day. I mean, like, oh, that's true, that's true. Like that's a true. crop top. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> no, but, yeah, um, what's the other day? I might, I, might, I might be a businesswoman. 
<laughs> oh, a suit. I can't wait I can't to wear a suit. I'm going to wear like my dad's suit. I'm going to look so fresh. I'm going to look so cool. Oh, I can't wait. It's going to be too big. what about Pirate Day? Yeah! There's no Pirate Day. I saw that was a suggestion. Yeah, that was like one of the suggestions. What the hell? Who wants to do that? <laughs> I know. Pirate Day. Like, Pirate Day. Oh, crazy. Like, <laughs> Whoa! Dress Captain your, Sparrow, wow! Dress as your favourite Disney character as well. Like, <laughs> I, don't I, have, that's I don't have, like, a yeah. Disney character fit, that's like, lying yeah. around. Mate, I would, I would definitely, uh, you know Tebow and Pumba? Oh, from the Lion King. Yeah, yeah. I'll definitely be Pumba. Pumba. <laughs> I love Pumba. I'm like, cruel the whole thing. <laughs> yeah. like, Sam, do you want to do Pumba together? I'll be the front, you'll be the back. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, right, anyways, guys. Anyways, guys. Um, today was a funky, funky Thursday episode. Yeah. Uh, funky yeah. Thursday? I should be funky. I funny. know, I know. I was, I was going to say... Uh, I like funky list. Thursday, but with a list. It's getting... List. Is it so getting uploaded Thursday? on Friday? No, it's not getting uploaded on okay, Friday. Okay, so it's almost funky Friday. Um, yeah. yeah. Uh, we're going to be doing No Wipe Challenge, guys. Yeah. Announced soon. Stay tuned. <laughs> yeah. Very big, soon. Big, uh, <laughs> big announcement coming up. And um, yeah, we might do something special for our tenth uh, podcast. Yeah, our tenth so. ten week anniversary. So is this our ninth one? It's our eighth one. Ah, guys, just hurry up. We need to go. Yeah. All right, see you. See you guys. Bye.